Which you guys got another video here for you. New hidden advanced settings for Windows 11. This is coming to all Windows 11 users and what Microsoft have announced and planned is to replace the for developers page in the advanced settings page. What they're going to do is give us a settings app and it's going to be much more easier to use. Now to use the Windows advanced settings is only for current beta versions that you see on the screen and it's also for the uh, dev builds as well. But you can unlock it if you want to take a look at it and I'll show you how to do that in this video. But first, let's have a quick word from today's video sponsor, CD Key Sales. If you're looking for cheap Windows 10 Pro and cheap Windows 11 Pro OEM keys, then check out the link in the video description. Use my promo code capital B capital R 09, apply that to your order and get a 30% discount on your purchases. Once you submit your order, they will send you your key. You can then activate your version of Windows like you see on the screen. Very simple and easy to do. Okay, so let's get back to how you can enable this feature on Windows 11 if you're running one of those builds that we mentioned earlier. So you can see by default here in the system pane right here, you can see that it's for developers right here. This is just under the multitasking here. That is how it is right now. But to enable the feature, what you need to do is I'm going to check and make sure I've got all of the latest updates on this system. And then you're going to need to download the Windows Advanced Settings app from Microsoft here. And once you've downloaded this, you click open and it will download the Dev Home right here and install it onto the system. Now, if you're in the Windows Insider program, uh, this is going to be pretty simple to do. If you want to do this outside the uh, Insider program, you're going to need to do something like this. So let me go ahead and finish this off once that's fully installed. You're going to need to be able to install the actual Vive tool here so we can actually install the code to release the actual feature. So the Windows version I'm running right here, you can see this is the build right here. And it's either this build or the beta build. So the beta and dev builds that are running those versions that I showed you earlier. But this is the version I was running here for this test, which was recommended by them to say this is the version you'll have to use. So download the Vive tool here, and what we're going to do is get the latest version and download the zip file, and we can extract this and put it into our downloads folder right here. So I'm going to go ahead and do all of that here. And what we can then do is go to our file explorer, go to our downloads directory. I've already unzipped it right here. And from here, you can right click on this and copy path. So let's go ahead and do that right here. Uh, copy as path. And then we can open up the command prompt. So I'm going to go ahead and do that by typing CMD in the search and open up the command prompt as administrator. And then once we say yes to the user account control, it should look something like this. Now we can change directory and then do uh, control V and then press enter. And this will change the directory to our folder, which is our Vive tool folder. Now we need to put in this code right here. This code will be in the video description if you want to try this out and push enter. And what this will do is hopefully successfully enable that feature. You will need to restart the PC. So let's go ahead and restart the PC here. And once we've restarted, we'll get back to the desktop and we'll take a look. Now, you're not going to have to do all of this once it's rolled out to the general public. It's going to come down as an update and it should work perfectly fine without doing all of this. This is if you are not in the Insider program and you want to try and do it on a virtual machine like I'm trying to do right here. So let's go into the Start button. Apparently, when you do this now, you click Settings, and in System, it should be there. Uh, but unfortunately, as you can see for me, it's not worked. But let me just show you exactly what this is going to look like because I know other people have got this working. But you can see on here, it's in the Developers. It should replace this and say Advanced here. But for me, it's not. And I tried both builds and it didn't work for me for some reason. So I just want to save you the time and hassle of going through all of that yourself. But you can see it's got the end task right here. You've got File Explorer. You've got Enable Long Paths right here. You can toggle that on. And you've also got other ones like Virtual Workspace, Remote Desktop. And you've got some other ones here like Enable, Sudo. Developer Mode is turned on here on this image. Uh, I did try turning it on, but it still didn't work. But you do have other features, which is going to gain you quick access to 
uh, the file explorer here where you can turn on show file extensions and show hidden file systems, show paths in title bar, and all of these settings will be available inside under the advanced options. So it seems like they're generally phasing out a lot of the other ways of doing it and putting it into this advanced settings uh, pane rather than going into developer mode. Now this feature was found by Phantom of the Earth and Alex, and these are the two people that have actually found out and worked this out. So kudos to those for doing all of their work to find these features for us so I can show you in real time. But unfortunately, it didn't work for me, and I will continue to try and get it to work. But anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Quick shout out to all my YouTube members who join my YouTube members group. I appreciate the support. I shall catch you in the next video or I'll catch you on our Discord server. The link is in the video description. Bye for now.